Hello everybody, this is Kevin from Klotz Productions, and this is game one of the finals at the Mirrodin Besieged pre-release. Harrison played the first spell of this game with the Leon and Sky Hunter. However, Kyle killed it immediately with a Burn the Impure. Kyle then resolved a Spin Engine. Harrison played Land Go on his next turn, and then Kyle started off his turn by attacking with the Spin Engine. However, Harrison destroyed it with a Burn the Impure. Then post-combat, Kyle resolved a Blister Stick Shaman and did 1 damage to Harrison, taking him to 19. Then Harrison put a Tumble Magnet into play. Kyle then used a Divine Offering to destroy the Tumble Magnet, so in response, Harrison tapped it to tap down the Shaman. Then Kyle gained 3 life, going up to 23. Harrison played Land Go again, and then Kyle took him to 17 with his Shaman. Then Harrison played Land Go once again, and at the end of the turn, Kyle cast a Shimmer Mirror. Kyle then attacked with his team for 4, taking Harrison down to 13. Harrison then cleared Kyle's board with a Slag Storm. However, Kyle then cast a Looming Grid Gargoyle. Harrison then resolved a Razor Hippogriff to return his Tumble Magnet to his hand and gain 3, going up to 16. Then he put the Tumble Magnet into play. However, Kyle destroyed the Tumble Magnet again with another Divine Offering, going up to 26 life. So in response, Harrison tapped the Magnet to tap down the Gargoyle so it couldn't attack. Then post-combat, Kyle resolved a Glint Hawk Idol. Harrison started off his next turn by attacking for 3 with the Hippogriff, taking Kyle down to 23 life. Then post-combat, he resolved a Blister Stick Shaman and did 1 damage to Kyle's Gargoyle, and then finished it off with a Burn the Impure. Kyle then played a Razor Hippogriff of his own and got his Gargoyle back, gaining 6 life and going up to 29. He then animated his idol and attacked for 2, taking Harrison to 14. Harrison then resolved a Peace Strider and gained 3 life, going back up to 17. Then on Kyle's turn, he resolved a second Looming Grid Gargoyle. Then for his combat, he attacked with his Hippogriff and his idol. Harrison decided to block the idol with his Hippogriff and kill it, and then take the 3 damage, going down to 14. Harrison simply played Lay and Go for his next turn, and then Kyle started off by laying down a Panic Spell Bomb. He then sacrificed it to keep Harrison's Hippogriff from blocking this turn and also drew himself a card. Then he attacked with his Hippogriff and his Gargoyle for 7, taking Harrison down to 7 life. Then post-combat, Kyle resolved a Leon and Skyhunter. Harrison then resolved a Sunblast Angel, destroying Kyle's Gargoyle and his Hippogriff. Then he attacked with the rest of his team for 8 damage, which Kyle decided to take, going down to 21 life. Then on Kyle's next turn, he resolved a Mere Battlesphere. Harrison simply passed his next turn back to Kyle, and then Kyle made himself two more mirror with a Master's Call on his turn. He then pumped his Battle Sphere with his six mirrors and attacked with the Battle Sphere and his Leon and Sky Hunter. This did six damage immediately to Harrison, dropping him to one life. Harrison blocked the Sky Hunter with his Hippogriff to kill it, and then he double blocked the Battle Sphere with his Peace Strider and his Sunblast Angel to kill it also. However, he didn't have any way to stop the six mirrors from killing him next turn, so scooped to Kyle, giving him the win and taking them to game two.